And welcome back. So uh, literally just taking right right where we left off. Uh, we're still in the, the lightning storm here. So hopefully we're going to try to get past this. And we don't get hit yet again. But something tells me Space Engineers doesn't uh, follow the, you know, not getting struck by lightning twice in a row. I mean, then again, I am working on a big, like, metallic structure in an electrical storm. So, probably not my smartest idea ever, I, ad I admit. And there, yeah, okay. Doing it yet again. So, I think we're gonna, we're gonna go inside here, and we're going to heal up yet again, and, um... Kind of play it safe until it's clear outside. So, because of that, oh, um, let's drop. I can't really drop anything. Right, you know what? Let's work on. Let's work on what we can in here. So, all right, we got. Let's bring this over. What do you mean I can't place light armor block? Let's see. What? Ah, always does that, right? There. Oh, oh, oh. How about now? Okay, that works. So I'm thinking like maybe this room is like a little bit bigger. And maybe even put uh, like a large uh, station uh, storage container down here. Because it should be able to fit it. That way, when I come back from mining trips and things like that, when we dump all of the ore, if there's anything left over, it can go directly in here. I'm also going to need some light down here, man. All right, let's see. Cargo. I want a large industrial... There we go. Nice. Oh, I need way more interior plates. Okay. Let's see what we can pull up here. Oh, we do have quite a bit. Nice. I wasn't, uh, Really expecting that. Okay, we need uh, just a little bit of everything else. Not too much, though, thankfully. I need those. We need some motors, I think. Construction components. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear you. Okay. Oh, I missed it by one? Seriously? Okay. And then we also need these. But I think we need, like, 40 of these if I'm not mistaken so let's go uh, over here to the production real quick and we'll get just a couple of those going okay all done I 
And it is functional. All right, cool. Uh, let's work on getting some conveyor tubes. We'll get that pipe curved and we'll get the basic one. And I think we need the cross pipe as well. Ah, oh, we need more interior plates. Seriously? Okay. That should be enough just for placing them. Alright, this is going to need that cross pipe. Like that. That way these can be connected. Like so. Wait, is there not a... Oh man, I could have swore there was a connection point. It's like, why is it so dark? I could have swore it had a... Uh... A flashlight there. Five. I didn't exactly line this up, so. Okay, and then four. There we go. All right, let's uh, see about getting this stuff all. construction components that I know uh, I'm gonna need small steel tubes yet again let's get 200 of those going got one up okay let's go get the motors now don't need that much Excuse me. <clears throat> Allergies. Did we... Did we not? Okay, I was, I was like, where did they go? I know we had them somewhere in here. Sometimes the jetpack can be a little annoying when you're trying to... Uh... I think I'm missing one down here. Yep, there we go. Okay. That makes it easy. So I just need interior plates now. Or at least a good portion of it. I may have to drill, or not drill, I'm sorry, um, disconnect that block just so I can access it nice okay so that's all connected what the oh <laughs> I was like how do I get out not burn yeah let's uh get rid of this real quick
Oh, I need construction components. There we go. It is all connected. Let's get this one situated. Cool. Sweet. Now we have a over overfill area uh, for storage. Let's also get some lights over here because that's one thing that we have been needing. Light. I can do a hanging light. You know what? Let's try this. Let's try this hanging light long one. Or the hallways. This might actually be pretty cool. Let's see if it'll actually. Yeah. All right. Hmm. I don't think it's gonna let us hang it on there because it has to hang, probably hang it off of a block. Which is fine. Because I could just go like this. Ah! Come on. Just kind of make a little bit of a... There we go. Okay, what does this need? Oh, we need bulletproof glass? That's fine. That's that's doable. I think I actually have some in here. Cool. Alright. Uh, moving on up. Moving on up. Sweet. Energy low. Okay, all right. Turn the light off. Oh, look at that. That is so cool. That gives off a really good amount of light. Look at it. This, like almost lights up this entire area over here. Oh, this is nice. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, let's get our uh, power back up. And also check on the storm. Clear. Okay, we can go back out and start working on the, the miner yet again. Cool. Wasn't, uh, wasn't destroyed, which is very good. Just working on the base here. Ah, I need more steel plates. Let's actually drop quite a few of this stuff in here because we don't need it at the moment. I need these. Okay. Uh, wheels, right? That was, uh, I think we needed the left ones. Yep, these are left. Oh wait, we gotta bring that out. We gotta bring that out just a little bit more. Uh, we gotta do two blocks more, I believe. All right, now we can bring out number eight, which is the left tires. Right? Yeah, left. Okay. Down here. Put the back one over there. And where is this one? This one is lined up. Right there. Okay. So it's I think it's is that lined up? Oh look at this. The lightning did hit the wheel. Took it out. That's fine. Well, I mean, not really fine, but...
What is that? I just want to make sure that nothing's like really hitting each other. Yeah, uh, see. This tire is up a little bit further. How's that? Oh, I see. Okay. So this kind of goes off of like a four block, I guess. So let's try doing this. Bring it forward one. And then we'll bring it back out. And then if we take care of that, it matches. Okay, cool. So then let's just get let's get this go across here just so it can, can support it. Okay, there we go. Oh, very nice, very nice. And then we will take out this one and put it back. That too is going to also need. Right? Yep. Sorry, I just want to make sure everything. And that does not line up. <sighs> it's all like trial and error with this game you know okay oh i see i see where i messed up it's got to go out one more like that okay there we go okay so we got eight wheels going we got the storage is going to be underneath so that way the power or not the power i'm sorry the center of gravity is going to be a lot lower and i think we're going to put the batteries on the side right here looks like there's enough room for two of them and that'll also really help with the keeping the weight in the middle Oh, there we go. So one thing I want to do is um, I was watching online. Oh, of course, it's low. Okay, okay. So one thing I was looking at was uh, doing almost like a crane arm that you can then control with like a turret control block. And using that as a, a a miner, essentially. So that way I can just stay in the vehicle and uh, mouse control where I want the, the arm to go while I'm, while I'm uh, drilling and mine that way. Once I get the chassis uh, nailed together, essentially, I'm going to uh, take it off of its support rack. But I also gotta add like gyroscopes and all sorts of stuff. I'm gonna try to do it like under the vehicle to kind of not just hide it, but fill in those areas. So that way we can use the other space for either aesthetics or the arm and all that stuff that we got to do. All right, I just want to make sure it's all lined up correctly over here. 
which it is not at the moment. Okay. All right. Now, what do we need for these? We're gonna need a lot of stuff. Okay. Let's see. Cargo. This is what the large cargo. Yep. Yeah. And we're gonna need the wheels as well. Only keeping it on for the for the fact that I need it for this. There we go. Now let's try this. Man, always need more construction components. I'm just going to add all of those to each of these real quick. Yeah, it looks like I'm going to need more small steel tubes on all of these. Except for the wheels, because I got the wheels done. Steel plates, large steel tubes, and small. Okay, so large and small and steel. We can do that. So we got... Let's do 40 of those. Let's do uh, 200 of those. And production, we're going to need skate a bunch. Okay, we got 100 of those. That should, uh, that should be enough. Very cool, very cool. We'll make sure it's all 100%, right? Cool, cool. Very good, very good, very good. Okay, now what I'm going to do is... Ooh, I'm running out of power. There we go. Get, give me the power. All the power. Okay. Let me see here. We got this going. Okay. There we go. There we go. And then we need to put a horse. All the stuff that we don't have out on us. So if we come down here. I'm gonna drop the stuff off, come to G, clear that, come to the cargo. Hit nine, boom, this should help. Okay, we need to get more. What do you mean? Darn it. It said that everything was taken out. Whatever. That's fine. Wait. Oh, for a second there, I was like, wait, something's wrong here. Okay. No, but everything's okay. Everything's okay. 
Okay, we need what? Displays and interior plates. That's the big one. We need interior plates. Lots of them. So we get some displays going. Okay, there we go. And a few more. Did we already go through all of our interior plates already? Holy crap. All right, let's get at least one of these going. There we go. Very cool. All right, how about this one? Just short. By a lot. There it is. Nice. Okay. So we got the base of it done. N what? Oh, no. Oh, man. Seriously? Well, Okay. I was not expecting that to do that. Well, hopefully we still have some stuff on us that we can redo it all. I swear I had computers on me, right? I don't. Okay. So, computers and construction components and interior plates. Uh, let's do construction components, interior plates. Steel plates. I think we need more construction components though. Okay. Hopefully this is enough. Of course it's not. We need more construction. Wait, was that construction components? Yes? Yes. And computers, which I guess where I had, but okay. Just take all of those. Are we out of construction components? No. Okay, go to production and let's get a hundred. That should be good. Very cool. All right, all right. So we now got the tanker essentially all set up there. Uh, so let's get 
Next thing we need to do is we need to work on the cockpit so we can put on the brakes and all that stuff. And for that, we're going to need interior plates, I'm pretty sure. Okay. So let's figure this out. Hmm. Well, the the buggy is two, but I think these are three. What do we got we got one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so that's still a three-parter in the middle here. So if I just put these as, come on, as spacers. Like that, I can then put the cockpit in the middle. So let's see, cockpit. We got industrial cockpit. Let's just see how that works. Yeah. I mean, I want, I don't mind it. It's definitely. Yeah, why not? Screw it. We just need metal grids. Okay. Metal grid, metal grid, metal grid. Back. What did I? Ah, oh, I can't believe it. I just put it back. Uh oh, I got another one uh, approaching. Is it? Uh, is it good? It is good. Okay, we got the parking brake engaged. And uh yeah. Okay. So that's that's that. Um I'm gonna call it here for the day, also because we're at time. But I will catch you guys in the next episode. Alright, see you later. Bye.